हेलो एवरी बड़ी वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल रज हम पढ़ना चाहते कैफिन को बारे में कैफिन को ओवर भ्यूज यूजेज साइड इफेक्टर प्रिभेन्सन को बारे में पढ़ना चाहते रैफिन के ओवर भ्यू कैफिन इज अ केमिकल फाउंड इन कफी टी कोल गोना मेट एंड अदर प्रोडक्ट्स कैफिन इज मोस्ट कमनली यूज टू इम्प्रूव मेट मेन्टल अलर्टनेस but it has many other uses caffeine is used by mouth or rectal in combination with painkiller such as aspirin and acetamorphin and a chemical called ero ergotamine for treating migraine headaches it is also used with painkillers for simple headaches and preventing and tr treating headaches after epidural anesthesia some people use caffeine by mouth for uh, asthma gall bladder disease attention deflect hyperactive disorder hdha and many other conditions but there is no good scientific evidence to support most of these uses caffeine is one of the most commonly used stimulants among athletes taking caffeine within limits is allowed by the national uh, collegiate uh, uh, athletic association ncaa Ur urine concentrations over 15 mcg ml are prohibited it takes most people about eight cups of coffee providing 100 mg cup to reach this urine concentration some caffeine products are sold in very concentrated or pure forms these products are a health concern people can easily use this product in doses that are much too high by mistake this can lead to death as of 2018 the u.s food and drug administration fda considers it unlawful for this product to be sold to consumers in bulk in food caffeine is used as an ingredient in soft drinks energy drinks and other beverages how does it work Caffeine works by stimulating the central nervous system (CNS) hot muscles and the centers of uh, centers that control blood pressure. Caffeine can raise blood pressure but might not have this effect in people who use it all the time. Caffeine can also act like a water pill that increase urine flow, but again, it may not have this effect in people who use caffeine regularly also drinking caffeine during moderate exercise is not likely to cause dehydration uses and effectiveness effective for migraine taking caffeine by mouth together with pain reliever such as aspirin and acetamorphine is effective for treating migraines caffeine is a fda approved product for use with pain reliefs for treating migraine headaches pauses in breathing that may be all uh, may be followed by low heart rate and low oxygen levels in newborns neonatal apn describes a condition in which infants have pauses in breathing that last for at least 15 seconds or this cause a serious drop in heart rate this condition is common in very Premature infants caffeine give, given by mouth or intravenously by for can improve breathing in very premature infants with condition. It also seems to reduce the number of episodes of pain by at least half over seven to ten days. Caffeine kitre is approved as a prescription drug for treating neonatal ap apnea in premature infants but caffeine does not seem to prevent this condition from developing in, in uh, premature infants headache after surgery using caffeine by mouth or intravenously is effective for preventing headaches following surgery caffeine is an fda approved product for this use uh, in which who regularly consume products that contain caffeine Tension, headache, tension, taking caffeine by mouth in combination with pain relief is effective for treating tension headaches. Likely effective for 
mental alertness research suggests that drinking caffeinated beverage throughout the day keeps the mind alert and might improve reaction times combining caffeine with glucose as an energy drink seems to improve mental performance better than either caffeine or glucose alone possibly effective for